Okay, here we are back at AMI for another unboxing, or as we'll say today, an unbagging. Uh, another Veritron product. Veritron are doing an amazing job at the moment with all their new N2K products. Uh, this product is a part of the LinkUp group. Uh, the LinkUp group is, a, at the moment, six of them in the series. This is the analog one, so this will plug into your N2K backbone and measures all your analog sensors. The other ones in the group is a J1939, which goes direct to your engines, to N2K. There's two IBS intelligent battery sensor versions, 112 volt, 124 volt, and a specialized one for pyrometers, which is, comes with a long pyrometer sensor uh, in the kit so that you can take your exhaust uh, temperature and it has that high range from 100 degrees plus for your exhaust temperatures. And the last one, not least, is a new one which will do temperature and pressure sensors. So, we're gonna be showing you the uh, analog one today. It uh, comes in a lovely blister pack. Now, what's so special about LinkUp Sys? If you come in close here, you'll see that there's a uh, little NFC chip signal device there. Now, you can change this device setting without having to power it up. Using a standard iPhone or Samsung, you have an app on your phone, you open up the app, like such, okay? It will say read, you'll see the reading, you put it and it reads. So you'll end up, you'll see a reading thing and then you can actually change the information. What will come up on the screen down here to the right will be all the different um, changes that we can do. But a quick one to go through will be fuel, wastewater, fresh water, coolant temperature, well temperature, etc., etc. There's uh, about uh, 12 different categories that you can do. In those categories, they'll have different uh, availabilities. You'll be able to measure tanks, uh, resistance, different levels uh, resistance. You'll have, uh, some will have the opportunity to put alarms on so that you can send an alarm signal out. For instance, a high temp alarm, um, a high pressure alarm, etc., etc. So, we'll give you a quick example of this plugged in. We'll grab a sensor, and these are VDO stainless steel pipe sensors. These are mainly used on fuel tanks. These are great, they're a lovely, uh, intrinsically safe uh, tank sensor. They uh, come in, you know, the shortest range is about this long, and they go all the way up to a couple of meters. So as you can see, the unit's flashing. Now, why is it flashing? Because it, just like the N2, other two N2K sensors from uh, Veritron, if it's flashing, it hasn't got anything connected to the end of it. So we'll plug in the sensor. It goes solid. And we'll just slide it up and down. And you'll see on our gauges over here that this value changes, okay? As a person that's not really shows much excitement in these product groups, I'm excited about this one. This one is going to be a great unit for anyone wanting to add any uh, N2K sensor to their existing MFDs or their existing N2K backbones. Go out and get them, check with your local distributors, uh, local resellers, um, that's it. Thanks for listening.